the scores to the big house crowd. Michigan fans went wild for that funny name school from western Pennsylvania. And the tradition of announcing the rock score spread to other schools across the nation, from Tuscaloosa to Austin. The bond between Michigan and Slippery Rock culminated in 1979 when they were invited to play in the big house against in-state rival Shippensburg. A Division II attendance record was set that day with a crowd of 61,143. The past few years, the Slippery Rock scores have disappeared from Michigan Stadium, but now the tradition is back. With Coach Mahalik at Michigan Stadium, Coach, what does it mean to Slip Rock football to be recognized by the University of Michigan today? Well, the University of Michigan, the big house, that was the original big house. And uh, along with the name Slippery Rock University, two legends of college football, we're very appreciative that they invited us here to be recognized today. You were here in 79 and 81, right, as an assistant coach. What does it mean to come back? Well, those two games, uh, my, ner my stomach was nervous wreck, and now today I can just enjoy the atmosphere of the big house. What are some of the things you remember from that 79-81 game? Well, you know, the opportunity to come out into a major college stadium and uh, you know, play in front of 62,000 people, still the largest crowd to see a Division II football game, you know, that in itself was very exciting. Okay, we're here with Rock Director of Athletics, Paul Lucas. Paul, tell me what you're feeling right now on behalf of Slippery Rock and personally being at the big house. Well, it's an exciting moment, Bob, and it's, uh, it's so nice, and they've treated us so well already, and uh, it's going to be a special day for Slippery Rock, and you can just feel the excitement in the air. It's awesome. Just going to validate the feeling that we are Snoopy college football, nation Snoopy of college football? I think it validates a lot of things, including that, but I think it validates that people are excited about Slippery Rock, and as we came walking in, people were yelling, hey, Slippery Rock, so it's, it's awesome. Nice shot. Will, will, will we be back in the big house playing soon? We sure hope so. We talked to uh, Dave Brandon, their AD, earlier today, and he is indicating very little would like to have us back, and this is just a start. Okay, we're here with Brandon Fusco at the Big House. Brandon, how do you like this? It's unbelievable. At the Big House, uh, it's a dream come true for me. Uh, I've never been to a stadium like this. Uh, it's a great atmosphere. I can't, what can I say? So. What does it mean to rock football to be honored at the Big House in front of 110,000 fans? Uh, it means a lot, you know. Uh, Slipper Rock's been a great program. We're coming here and you know, everyone asks, oh, you're from Slipper Rock? Yeah, you know, everyone knows about you. It's, it's an unbelievable experience and it's a great honor coming here. So. Is this a good way to close out your career? Oh, definitely. Uh, didn't think I was going to be able to do this, but yeah, definitely a great uh, career or anything. What's it, how's it feel? You're the captain. You're representing Slip Rock University. All the players who've ever played at Slip Rock, the guys who played in 79, 81. Tell me what it feels like for you personally. To be done? No, to be here. Oh, to be here? Jeez, I mean, like I said, it's an honor. You know, not many people get to do this, take this opportunity, but you know, I'm here. And uh, you know, it feels good. I, I don't know what else to say. It feels good to be here. Yes. <laughs> All right, we're here with Aaron Nall at the Big House in uh, Ann Arbor, Michigan. Aaron, tell me what you're feeling right now. I mean, I've never experienced anything like this before in my life. I'm just, uh, you know, it's overwhelming. I mean, how many people get the opportunity to have 100,000 people cheer for you? What does it, uh, as a senior, a good way to cl close out your career coming to the big house. Yeah, it's an amazing opportunity to be here. And, uh, you know, that means a lot to me to have this opportunity. And I'm just glad that, you know, I'm able to be here. I got to ask you, as, a, as an Ohio native, a little mixed emotions coming to Michigan the week before the Ohio State game? No, no, I'm a Michigan fan now. I'm a Michigan fan now.